Oh, oh, right. Fucking like John King doing his thing. Woo! Um, Phil F, you're on deck for lucky lottery slot number nine. Right now, please welcome to the stage Phil, or no, he's on deck. Don't smoke weed before show Nico Dio's DMT! Nico Dio's! Oh my god, they mucked up this microphone. Oh my oh, what god. To they slaughter on the microphone. I wonder who that was. I wonder. You could, yeah. Try to like keep my distance. Um yeah. Okay. I got these notes. But uh maybe I can remember. Uh, you know. I'm old. No. I'm actually old, no. but uh, I'm young in my heart. Well, everyone knows that. Uh, I'm actually, I'm old, but I'm bad. Uh, I, um, I'm, I'm, I'm like, uh, I'm like a little girl. <laughs> I get hysterical. Every time things don't go my way, I start screaming and stamping my feet up and down. <laughs> Everybody knows. Everybody knows. But um, this is my thing now. I, uh, I'm going into a new bar scene. The old bar scene out. The new bar scene in. So uh, I decided no more cheap bars. <laughs> Screw that cheap bar. Because what do they want to do? They, you always go over there and get drunk. <laughs> You know, because the bars, the drinks are so cheap. And on top of which, the cheap bar, the bartenders buy half the drinks for me. <laughs> I don't know why, but they do it. And so I get crazy drunk. Actually, one of the cheap bars, they got kicked out of a couple of times and I went back. And then I got really skunk drunk in it. It's um, El Loco. It's a taco place on Avenue A. Anybody oh. been in there? No. Uh, anyway, yeah, Tony been there. Anyway, uh, I was over there after I got kicked out a couple of times, you know, had a lot of trouble. Then I got so drunk, I kicked in the bathroom door. Whoa! And, but guess what? I forgot. I didn't even know. So I went home and I, actually I had a bad night when I went home. I, <clears throat> I fell and I knocked over all kinds of junk in the house. And, um, and so then I vowed. No more cheap bar. From now on, pricey bar, expensive bar. So the first place I could think of was I went to the Bourgeois Pig. <laughs> now, have you been there? No, yeah. no, no. Yeah. yeah? Which one? Well, Stick up your hand. I've been there. You've been there? Yeah. Oh, my God. How did that happen? Anyway, so I went there and <clears throat> I asked him, can I get a drink? There's no, there's a wine bar. You knew that, right? Yeah. Good. Anyway, so I, uh, <clears throat> so I asked them, uh, hey, uh, you know any other places? And they said, oh, you want a cocktail bar? Now, I didn't even know there was especially a cocktail bar. I've been by them, but I never knew because they usually blocked off on the outside. So she said, it's over on the other side, the next street opposite this. So I go there. And it's called Death and Company. Yeah. You've been there? Oh, it's hot bar. Oh, oh, oh. it is a very hot bar. Now they're not even going to let you in. That's the way it is. It's it's a hot bar. You know, it's not for like you know cool dudes like me. You got to be hot. Anyway, actually, the first time I went there, they let me in. There was happened to be one seat at the bar, and I um I got my seat, I got my drink, and I was happy. So got one drink, and then I said, no, nah, I'm going to call it quits. The woman I was talking to for the entire drink, uh, she left. So I, and she recommended I try this other bar, another cocktail bar, a tequila bar, because the drink that I drink is a margarita, you know. 
Now, how many different kinds of margaritas are there? Freaking a lot of them, I'll tell you that, right? You know, everybody got their own little formula for the margarita. Me, personally, I have one, and it is the best one of all the ones in, you know, probably the world. You know. No, no, no. It's so simple, so straight. I'm not going to explain this, because then you'll all be stealing my ideas. And I'm going to wait till I open up my own freaking margarita bar. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to open up a margarita bar. I'm going to serve another margaritas, but I'm going to charge $20. That'll keep all yous out. Keep all yous out. Only the rollers. This is all I'm interested in. Anyway, so uh, I went to the other... After I went there, the next night I went to the other the, um, the tequila bar. Uh, you know, you can barely see it. You know which one that is, John? What is it? The tequila bar? Mayaguel. Mayaguel. You've been there? No, no. It's kind of hidden. It's, it's a little spooky. Actually, the last time I went there, which was on Saturday night, which you can't go anywhere on Saturday night, I just felt like going and getting a drink, you know. And, uh, but they said no, because the bar was full and the other bar was full. So I just went home, you know, I figured, well, I saved a couple of pennies anyway. No, actually, I went somewhere. What day was um, thanks, um, Thanksgiving? I mean, uh, St. Patrick's Day. That was Thursday? Saturday. Oh, that's right. Huh. No wonder. I'm fighting the big crowd. Holy mackerel. So I did wind up in a dump, you know, uh, which is seven apes. You know, I go there. Well, actually, they kicked me out of there 49 times. So now I'm, you know, really treading lightly. But I went there, and I got a drink, you know. The guy asked me, what kind of tequila you want? I says, give me the Don Julio, you know? And I had it, and still it was bad. They, they, they got a knack. People got knack, you know, bad taste. This is what people got. Nothing but bad taste. You say, well, who's got the good taste? I don't know. I don't know. The closest I came is in the bar I was in last night, which is Death and Company. And uh, there was great. I, I go to the door, and the girl is on the door, and, and I said, can I get in? And she says, well, let me take a look. So she goes inside, and then a little while later, some people come out. Then she comes out. She says, well, okay, maybe i got a seat for you at the bar. I said, well, okay. So I go in after her. Guess what? There's nobody sitting at the bar. All the stools are empty. I said, wow. Wow. <laughs> Thank you very much. Wow. Wow, it's Nico right. Nico Diaz, D-I-T. Oh, yeah. Nico Diaz.